Oh, uh, by the way, yeah, I guess, guys, if you haven't noticed, I'm not reading all the dialogue out loud anymore. I, I gave it a try my last session. It was, it was about five and a half hours. And I don't know. I didn't, I didn't really, I didn't really like it too much. I like, I prefer to just respond to whatever is happening in the dialogue. Um, but if, uh, if I, if you guys, uh, let me know that you want me to read it, then, then I will. Oh, we already talked to Carlos. He can't leave. Uh, okay. We did come by the Ison Road. Hey, wait a minute. Um... What's the significance of that? How did we get through? Oh, right. Because because it's supposed to be barricaded. Jeez, it didn't take me long to forget that. It, well, it, it wasn't really much of an ordeal getting through there, so I guess it's kind of understandable. Yeah, we're, our, we're on a mission, guy. Let us through. Well, that's understandable. These guys, these guards, man. Okay, he's out. Everybody's out when we're looking for him. Searches for, for people, I suppose, from the missing airship or for the missing airship. Yeah. Just tell us where he is. He'll be back sometime today. Okay, there's a bar at the rest stop over there. Why don't you wait for him there? Okay. And you'll come find me? Okay. Well, it's like the last pit stop, the last red stop, rest stop, like on the, on the highway when you see those signs, last rest area for 200 miles or whatever. Oh, that too. So it's like, uh, kind of like an airport in that sense. You might have to spend quite a bit of time waiting. Okay. Actually, can I just go in there? No. Can I read the sign? Cannot. Cannot read the sign. There's nothing else, right? Can't just walk through there. All right. We'll wait here. Did we go upstairs? We did not, but there's nothing up here, so. All right. Oh, okay. Now we can have now we can have that conversation. We are citizens of the world. Not going through, right? We just want to talk to the general. Okay, so he is an Erebonian citizen. Work and pleasure, okay. You know exactly who we are. Okay, now they're, they're gonna get nervous. Oh, he actually did. I thought it was gonna be something different. Yeah, racers. Okay. Oh, okay. So he, he knows people who are bracers and we remind them, him of them. So. Right. What is your profession? What kind of work? are you in just like a glass of exquisite brandy okay um yeah we're not gonna do that why is it everyone is interested in joshua Okay, that's interesting. Supernal melodies and cleansing landscapes. Supernal? 
I'm not familiar with that word. Hang on. Let's... Let's learn here. Supernal is relating to the sky or the heavens. Celestial. Okay, so like heavenly melodies. Alright, cool. So pretty things and tasty things. Got it. That is not exactly what I got out of that. But maybe also that. Uh, it is true that highly intelligent people or geniuses are often eccentric and misunderstood. We don't know that that is necessar that it's necessarily true that he is a genius, though. <laughs> You've already scarred me for life. <laughs> the, the bartender having fun with it. Hey, you three. All right. Okay, cool. Immediately. He's quite bossy. Um... Excuse me? Um... Get out of here. At least he didn't, like, push the issue. Right, he's not normal. Well, I mean... All we needed to know is that he has a portrait. Right? Getting rid of that weirdo. A service for the world? Hmm... We don't necessarily know that yet. Nothing we couldn't handle. Last door on the left. Make sure you don't go wandering around in other places where you're not permitted, he says. Hmm. Hmm. Well... I permit myself to have a look around. Therefore, I am permitted. I have a mayor's, I have a mayor's note. You, so, you just don't worry about it. Do what I want. Always confronted with threats from the Empire. I thought there was a truce. Okay, okay, so not necessarily actual military action, but just the threat of it. Is that is that uh, perceived or actual? You know, is the, is the Erebonian Empire actually threatening, or are these guys just paranoid? Yeah. Hopefully, it doesn't come to another war. Ugh, that sucks. Have to work your off day. Is there anything? Look at all of these apples and beans or whatever's in there. Why can't I just, you know, put a couple of those in my pocket? Then go to bed, dude. Last door on the left? Uh, let's go past that. Aw, blocked. Why knock? 
We have a we have a letter from the mayor. We can just walk in. That's right. We have a letter. Open up. That guy, his character model, not his portrait, his character model, reminds me of like character models from like Final Fantasy Tactics. That's a great game, by the way. Okay, you know, okay, so the queen might have a little bit more pull around here than the mayor. Maybe. Doesn't look very busy. Uh huh. Do we get that back? That's kind of my. Uh, I was I was kind of using that to to barge into places. Uh, I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna need that back. Okay, good deal. Yeah, yeah. Um, well, a, an airship went missing that probably had more than just a couple people on it. Uh, it, it might concern us. We might have had a cousin or, you know, somebody. Right, we just, we want to make the mayor feel better. We're the best people. Just ask, we'll tell you. Carry on. You know, I walked from Roland to Bose in about 10 minutes, if that. So where could it have disappeared to, really? Uh, it's 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 just not the scale. We we can pretend that it took us, you know, the whole day in game time or something. Right. Right. Okay. Went over the Ocean? It would have had to have gone out of its way quite a ways to get to that lake or the ocean, though. Cargo or ransom, okay. I that's I was thinking it was probably hijacked. All right, we're blaming the empire already. Yeah. I think he's about to say just hang on a minute there. Oh, impressive assessment. So he's oh, he's he's right on board with the conspiracy theories like instantly. Let's, let's just jump to basically the worst possible scenario. Okay, keeping things hush-hush. Well, if they hijacked an airship with, with citizens on it, that, that would be an act of war, wouldn't it? Oh, okay, so we're about to learn something. Disappeared. The possibility of a, the war disappeared early this morning, he says. Okay. The Kapua family. We should have known. Yeah.
Yeah, uh, we've heard of them. But yeah, they should have they should have had someone else doing the talking. Ah, uh, he knows. Silence, deceivers. Okay. Okay. We're gonna get thrown into the brig, aren't we? Oh, no, no. We're just gonna be escorted out. Alright. Fair enough. That's what deception gets you. You should have just been honest from the beginning. Well, maybe not. Right. Hiding so we could finagle. Okay. Finagling. Are we a civilian group? Pretty widespread. People turn to the bracers for help with all kinds of things. Where you didn't get in the way. Yeah. Boom. Laying it down. Don't backpedal now. Right, yeah, you let the Kapua family build up too much influence. They probably were able to grow their organization, so... Really? It's your fault. Right, exactly. Nah, I don't think- I don't think you're gonna silence her. <laughs> you jump to conclusions, though. Um, who said anything about letting them escape? I mean, they did, but nobody said anything about it. Right? He just like jumped over there. Strife brings nothing to be born, but only extends the barren wilderness within our hearts. He's he's a like a traveling musician, and yeah, play us something nice. I can't actually, I can't advance that. All right, so. Okay. He, he definitely has passion. He can rhyme. We'll have to open up your heart for that to be true. Or your chest, anyway. Is this supposed to be uplifting or depressing?
It seemed like it was about like heartache more than more than any some anything like purely positive. Did really? Love and peace. Yeah, sure. That, those are good things. Well, we have a letter from the mayor, General Morgan. We can go as we please. I want to hear what the search party has to say. Um, cancel any further checks, he said. So does that mean... Whoa, look at... Look at the musician over there. His sprite is in like eight pieces. Wow. That's not normal. Interesting. I, yeah, I mean, he's he's obviously like a specter or some sort of ghost. I wish we could escape from him. Holy smokes, look at him. Okay. Military people are, in general, fairly practical. We need to we need to get the deb debriefing on the search party. He's coming with. Is he going to be like a Kapua spy? Oliver Ol Olivier Lenheim. Hmm. Wandering bard and musician. Okay. Yeah, he kind of stopped the confrontation. It didn't have... It, he didn't produce the outcome we would have liked, though. And why were we, like, leaving the area and now we're at the end? I don't know, Sarah. I think we could have taken him. Yeah. There's never enough free time, I'll tell you that. He, he thinks it's humor, okay. Right. I think Olivia was pretty serious. Yeah, what's, <laughs> what's wrong with Estelle? Ouch. Is it behavior or appearance, then? Ouch. Also, she's only 16. I don't know. How useful are you? He could play us some music and things. Yeah. Might be one of our duties, but we get paid. We're like a witcher.
I don't think that's gonna happen. <laughs> let's not let's not delve too deeply into this. we've already concluded Estelle no no it's not definitely not well you can count on us oh my goodness Estelle ugh her comments just made it worse. Oh, he has oh uh, he has help and Alright, 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 alright. What does he use? He's got a gun. Needler. This guy. Nice. This guy plays Halo. Um <laughs> Quick Draw, Howling Bullet. Just uh, work boots and a leather jacket, though. How good is that stuff? Operated. Range plus four. Oh, okay. That's just... It's, so it doesn't his, his range is five so it doesn't give him like an additional plus range whatever on what a gun would be that is the gun's range is four okay up one hit one attack one wow he's got five slots open Hey. Oh, those are what the empty slots look like. I was looking at the diagram, like on the right. And those two, the one at the top and the one at the top on the right, are just empty slots. Like, who has an empty slot? Nobody. Nobody else has an empty slot. Okay. We can stick some stuff in there. Oh, this. We can give him a heal. That's it. Alright. Let's save. There was quite a bit of dialogue there. Oh. I have to go to a second page if I want to keep... You know what? Ten slots should be enough. Now, maybe it wouldn't be a bad idea to keep all my save slots, you know, individually throughout the entire game in case I need to go back for something. 